In a recent interview, President-elect Donald Trump reaffirmed his pledge to implement the most extensive deportation initiative in U.S. history with no financial constraints. Trump's stance underscores a commitment to bolstering national security and border control. He has emphasized that his administration will have no choice but to act decisively, particularly in response to crimes associated with drug trafficking and violence, which he claims are perpetrated by some undocumented individuals. Trump's message reflects a tough-on-crime approach, linking immigration enforcement directly to public safety. Throughout his campaign, Trump's message on immigration resonated with a wider coalition of voters than in previous elections, gaining traction not only among his traditional base, but also among Latino, young, and Asian American voters. He attributes his victory to his clear stance on immigration, suggesting that Americans desire both secure borders and a lawful path for immigrants who come in with love for the country. This perspective, he believes, represents a broad public sentiment that favors legal immigration while upholding national security. Post-election, Trump has engaged in constructive talks with current administration leaders, including Vice President Kamala Harris and President Joe Biden, with a shared commitment to a smooth transition of power. Trump described these conversations as respectful, underscoring the importance of a peaceful transfer. As part of his broader international strategy, Trump also spoke with several global leaders, including Israeli Prime Minister Benjamin Netanyahu and Ukrainian President Volodymyr Zelensky, though he has yet to speak with Russian President Vladimir Putin. Trump reiterated his campaign promise to pursue peace in Ukraine, vowing to broker an end to the conflict, which he has suggested would be a priority in his diplomatic efforts with a focus on both national security and robust global relationships, Trump's upcoming term will be closely watched for the impact of his policies on immigration and international diplomacy.